Ring in the new year with amazing savings from Appalachian Wireless. Get the Galaxy S7 for just $49.99 when you sign or renew a two-year service agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Astronomy and photography enthusiasts of all ages in our region have been counting down the days until NASA's Hubble Telescope Traveling Exhibit opens to the public in Prestonsburg. Yesterday morning, the exhibit arrived in three semi-trucks, and on Saturday, NASA's largest traveling exhibit will open to the public at the East Kentucky Science Center. This is an exhibit that was put together by the Hubble uh, contractor, Lockheed Martin, the Smithsonian Institute traveling exhibit group, and the NASA Hubble team at the Space Telescope Science Institute. The 2200 square foot exhibit will immerse visitors in the history of the Hubble mission and detail hundreds of interesting facts about NASA's Hubble Space Telescope. You first find out what is Hubble. It's the size of a school bus. Uh, what is Hubble capable of doing in terms of the images it's able to see to the earliest galaxies uh, in, the, in the universe. The exhibit is full of images and data taken by Hubble of planets, galaxies, and even regions surrounding black holes. Visitors will see a scale model of the Hubble as well as components of the massive telescope. This might be the most technological exhibit we've, we've ever set up and uh, normally it takes seven days and we're trying to have this ready in four. So uh, you can see all the people working here today from all over the place. The exhibit opens to the public on Saturday and will remain at the East Kentucky Science Center through August. And while there are many people looking forward to seeing the Hubble exhibit, you won't find anyone more excited than the Science Center director himself. Personally, the Hubble has always been, been something to me that was the best uh, mechanical device we've ever sent into space. So to have this here as a personal reason, I'm, I'm, I'm a kid in the candy shop with this, yeah. Reporting in Prestonsburg for EKB News, I'm Shannon Deskins.